Talent Squad. What is going on, guys? Mr. Talent here, coach of your New York Marauders. And we are in week 10 right now, my friends. Going up Galactic Elliot and the Chicago Cub Chews. And man, oh man, the playoff race is tight. And we got to be on our A game to make sure we make those playoffs. We got our squad right here. We are ready for action. And honestly, I'm nervous, man. It's a tough game. We got to get the W. We want to go in the playoffs. We are 5-3-1 and one right now. And uh, get, uh, Elliot's right behind us. He's 4-5. and five. So if he wins this, we're still going to be ahead of him. But we just want to win. We want to control our own fate, to be honest. So that's going to be our goal right now, Marauders fans. So... Week 10 is here, and then we have a week off with the reason. Oh, so I think we have two weeks off before the last week, something like that. I don't know exactly what it is, but there will be no content WBE wise next week, my friends, because we are off for the release of Ultra Sun and the Ultra Moon, and then we come right back into it. So get ready for our little, our little break. But for now, we got a great battle coming in high against Elliot in the Chicago Cup shoes. Like I said, I'm a little nervous. I'm going to hope everything works out fine. Plaza has been iffy recently because we're doing the updates on it and everything. So I'm really hoping there's no connectivity issues or anything like that. I just want to get a nice, clean battle. Get that W and move on into week 11. Hopefully 6-3-1 and because I think we're 5-3-1 right now. Some of my hockey team, which is actually really weird. But, yeah, we got to, we got to, uh... We got to get the dummy, man. We got to control our own fate, and that is that. Keeping our own hands right now, my friends. My hair is looking weird, but good today. I don't know what's going on there. I just woke up after hockey. Just, <laughs> I don't know, man. I'm liking it today. Makes me not want to get a haircut, but I, I'll get a little haircut going on. But you guys don't care about that. You care about this game right now as our man Elliot choosing his squad. And like I said, I just really hope there's no connectivity issues. Hope everything is good to go. Oh, I'm nervous, guys. I think I'm just going to go straight up Stealth Rocks turn one and Mega Evolve turn one. Make sure I get the extra book with the Aggron. Because when one thing kind of plagued me sometimes in the previous games is that not getting my Ag Mega Aggron evolved right away. Uh, and I don't have that chance to switch to something that I want to. The thing is, obviously, we know he's going to bring Excadrill for Rapid Spin and whatnot. If he does bring Excadrill, you better, you, you better bet your bottom dollar I'm leading Aggron and getting my rocks up. I'm almost positive he's going to bring it. What are they exactly? It's right there, my friends. That is the squad. Pretty much what Sia predicted. So, I'm going to get a pick of this team. And we're going to move into turn one once I choose my lead. I, I, I don't want to go Aggron because if he goes Volcarona or like... I mean, my extra could definitely go. I mean, my uh, Agron go toe to toe with extra could definitely EQ and whatnot. Um. Oh man, what do I do? I think I might just do it. I might just go Agron just because. You know what? F it. I'm doing it. I don't even care, man. I'm nervous. I don't know exactly what's gonna go on right now. We're just gonna get wild and crazy, and we're gonna see. Let me just before this. Let me just count right away how much an Agron or Mega Agron does to an. Excadrill with our EQ. Because I don't think... I'm definitely not fully invested in the attack. I can tell you that right now. So... Uh, before this time runs out, my Ag runs EVs are right here. Let's see. Uh, we have like no defense at all, which is fine. No prob at all. Just give me four attack points. I could definitely... Have a, I have a 44% chance to all co and his EQ does... Really good amount to me. Holy crap. Why does it do so much? Oh, it's out of my life. I don't know if it's going to be that. I don't know, guys. Either way, I'm going for it right now. That is our lead week 10 of the WB on the way, guys. Let's get a nice solid win right now. We need to smooth sail into the playoffs, my friends. I really want to make it. And that will be that. My friends, trust me about this EQ does so much. Mega Aggron. I filter. Uh, I'm not impish. That's why this is still, dude. All right, we'll go Mega Agron leads. That's what you got. Rosalina! Soka Kiss! Oh, it's beautiful. We can easily just scare you with Heavy Slam. Uh, let's see what a flamethrower from, from you does to me. Because you might be Specs. Because obviously I have Heavy Slam. Uh, all right, let me just change it to Heavy Slam. Because I got to see what a flamethrower or Aura Sphere does to me. From a Soka Kiss. This is going to be good news or bad news. Heavy Slam is not going to kill it. Assuming you're max defense. Or a defensive set. Um, oh, I'm nervous now. I'm nervous, I'm nervous, I'm nervous right now. Because it could do good damage with Aura Sphere and Flamethrower. So if you expect something crazy. Oh, man. Uh, I'm just going to get aggressive here. I'm going to Mega Evolve. I'm going to go Rocks. I don't think this thing's going to stay in. Alright, he's staying in. So he's going for an attack right now. I'm going to Mega Evolve. 
It's a scary, but my boy Klungo! I need you to not die like a flamethrower something, man. I need you right now, buddy. I need you. I need you. Okay, so we get rocks passed right back at me. That is not good, I believe. Yeah. All right, how's the last four? So he gets his rocks up. I get. I have my rocks up. That's not good because I don't have Finny at all. That's a beautiful turn for Elliot right there. I wonder if I could do it again. I'm just gonna go for it again. Get rocks on both sides. I I've never seen Magic Core. If I bounce this back again, well, egg on my face. I don't know, man. But I'm gonna just do it again. I don't care. I really don't care that the rocks are my side of the field. It's gonna not affect you too much. My team is pretty good against rocks. It is way more lethal against you than it is for me. I don't care. I will trade rocks for rocks right now. I'm nervous, guys. I don't even know. I don't even know right now. Like, I'm just gonna. It's definitely some kind of support set, which confirms his EVs are definitely not offensive, in my opinion. Well, it's just like three attacks and then magic coat. I don't know. That was really risky there in his part. Cause I remember when Heavy Slam right off the bat, and I saw that. Whoo, Nelly! But he he got risky. It pays off, and now I gotta deal with the rocks on my side of the field for the whole entire game because there is no hazard removal. On my team. Fire Blast it is. Alright. I'm pure such a wall. So I'm not gonna hurt that bad at all. Yeah, we're fine. Eat that up all day. We will get effing burned though. God damn it, dude. That hurts. That really hurts. Alright, I'm gonna save him for his bulk. That hurts so bad. I'm about to bring in Cressy and just poison this thing or something. I don't even know. I think we should bring in Cress here. I'm not dealing with burnt Agron. I can just poison things. I, I, I'm very upset right now with that. Uh, if he brings in Mole Breaker, uh, Hydrate, um, Excadrill, I'll probably bring in, uh, I'll keep it. I, I can't do anything actually. This is my best bet against his Crest, so uh, I'm just gonna switch him out. I'm gonna switch him out, and you might go to Excadrill. You might. Let's see here. I take rock damage. What do you do? You go Fire Blast again. It ain't gonna do jack. It is not gonna do jack. All right. Um. Pretty sure you're gonna bring in the Excadrill right now. And if you do, I do have my scarf in the game, but I don't know if you're scarfed or anything. I might try to go with Toxic here, but if I'm Elliot, I bring an extra drill against this thing every time. I'm almost positive you're bringing an extra drill here. If I'm Elliot, I bring an extra drill right now. But I don't know. I'm not Elliot, obviously, so I don't know exactly what he's going to want to do here. Planet Sif could be toxic. We both might status each other. I'm just going to go toxic. Let's see if extra drill comes in. Marina, that's going to be Vaporeon. All right, uh, you probably have um, what do you call? It? You probably have um, heal, 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 uh, heal bell, whatever the hell this thing gets. I will poison, which is nice, getting this like nice longevity damage on you. But uh, I'm pretty sure you're going to see the heal bell right now. But if we do that, it allows Zerk to come in, get a free uh, free hidden power off, hidden power ground, I believe, for the uh, for the what do you call it? For the ex extra drill. Uh, uh, yeah, hidden power grab. I can do that. Um, I'll bring in Zerk. I'm gonna get aggressive, guys. I'm gonna stay aggressive right now. I'm gonna keep switching in and out. I'll take the rock damage. It's fine. I'm gonna try to call the extra drill or the healing wish here. And that's because I'm gonna go. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get, him. I'm gonna get extra right here, guys. Watch. We're gonna get him right here. We're gonna bait it out. We're gonna bait that man out. Show me the healing wish or the heal bell. It's gold. That works. All right. It's gonna do a little bit of damage there. Poison's gonna add up on you. You might go protect here. Ooh. Um. You actually might even go Gudra. I'll go ahead and power ground still, though. Though. Definitely gonna do that. Cause I think he's like, oh, actually we can come in for free right now. We're gonna try to bait. We're gonna try to bait this man. If he goes protect, so if he goes in the skull, that's really gonna really, 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 really gonna suck. No, I really can't afford that. If I lose Zerk this early for basically no reason, it's going to be bad news bears. But I'll take a little chip damage on my Zerk to bait out this extra drill and try to get that hidden power ground off on it. If I don't get it, it's going to hurt. 
it's gonna hurt. But I'm gonna uh, uh, worst case scenario, you stay in. Second worst case scenario, you're bringing Gucha. Best case scenario, we see we catch Excadrill. I really want to catch it. He stayed in. He stayed in. Maybe he has a combat. I don't know. That just sucks. That just flat out sucks. This man has balls to stand against Zerkatry. Man has some huge balls right now. All right. Um, we lose Zerk there. That's honestly horrendous. I could just bring in Nidoking or Revenge Kill it. Do you have any uh, Grand Immunities? Let me just see your team real quick. You have the Togekiss. I'll just Poison Jab. Take the Rock Damage, Poison Jab you, and then... If you bring an Extra Joe, you got me, man. You got me. Bring in Nidoking, that's fine. Alright, I guess I gotta play safe against Elliot because uh, I wouldn't kill that thing right there with the T-Bolt. But I guess he wanted to stay in. I, I, I don't know. I tried to get the read, it didn't pay off, and now we're really behind the eight ball. Burnt Aggron, dead Zerkatry. Not what you want, man. But killing my opponent here would be really nice. Um, even better. I would love if you brought in Togekiss right now. I would love it, but you're not going to. You're going to let Marina drop. At least I think you are. I guess I got a little too gunk home, man, with the, uh, with the Zerk. Got way too good. I, mean, I I I I don't agree with I don't agree with Elliot's play there at all. I guess that's I don't know, man. I guess he, maybe he does have a Wakanberry. It's why he stayed in. There's been no item reveal just yet at all. But even then, like I I, I don't know. And I guess I, was, I also couldn't go receive on him. I guess he was thinking next is already poisons. Uh, I got too zesty. But T-Ball, like he could easily get into Gujar or actually been perfectly fine. That's why, like I don't know. I guess he was scared of Zemos at that point. I I don't know. It's my own fault, I guess. I should have. I guess I should have. I guess he was thinking about that, and I, I, I uh, overestimated that. I don't know, but I'm really upset with those Zerk so early, guys. I'm really upset with those Zerk so early. It was really bad, like really bad. So I'm gonna go poison jab here. If it brings in the Tokikis, so be it. Great. I'll be actually best case scenario. Best case scenario, Sip switch out to Tokikis. Worst case scenario, he gets the read and goes to the exit drill. I, I don't know how we get that read, but. Let's see if he does it. Are we scouting? He bears now he bears protect. Um now the question is. I'm pretty sure two EQs are like kill my crest. And you're gonna die to rocks if you switch it back in. So I'm just gonna go poison jab again. If you bring an extra drill soul beat, I will stack off the uh aggron. Oh man, Floats is gonna be very important now. Floats is gonna be the extra joke killer. Floats was gonna be the sweeper. Floats is gonna be the one that wins the game for us. Alright, we get the kill right here. That is the end of the Marina. One kill for the other king right there, but I'm just not happy. You could easily bring in You don't know if I'm you don't know if I'm scarfed or not yet. You don't know anything about my uh Nitter King, because I could be easily the life orb right now. But you know you, you know nothing right now, so hopefully, uh I don't know, hopefully he's scared. Then uh, he doesn't bring an extra drill. Because if he does, he's, he's got to spin. Actually, he's going to spin with extra drill. And when he does that, I'll bring in my Aggron and just get chip damage on it, hopefully. And put it in EQ, uh, Aqua Jet range. Or even Waterfall range of Floatzel. Assuming he's not Scarfed. I don't know what his extra is going to be. I would love to see Life Orb, to be honest. Uh, if he's Scarfed, um, I think Crest can take two EQs. If he's not scarfed, then um, I don't know if Crest takes two EQs from its range. I'll do the calc if the time comes, but I'm pretty sure we're gonna see extra drill right now. We do tie the game up, but we're not. We're way behind, guys. You get such advantage with the switch right here, knowing that I'm locked. You don't know I'm locked to poison gym. Let's see what you do. Anything but extra drill, I might just stay in and poison gym again. Except for Metacham, I would probably bring an aggro and deal with the fake out high jump kick gargle. Oh, I bring in Crest against the Metacham. So, ah, 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 ah. It is a weird matchup, guys. Monty Mole is going to come in. Yep. All right, there it is. Uh, I wonder if he's... He's going to go for... He's going to go for the... Uh, yeah, I'm going to bring an Aggro on here. He's going to go for a Rapid Spin. If I wasn't burnt, I'd be a lot happier. But... Getting Nidoking King out of here. Bringing our Aggro on. Uh, we're going to either catch an EQ or we're going to see a Spin. He goes to the EQ. Alright, we're gonna stack off Klungo here. I might live one. Probably not, though. Oh, we will live one. Oh, wow. Look at that. Alright. 
So it's, at least this forces you not to spin. Are you life orbs? There is no life orb. I want to say you're scarfed. Fluff. That is not good. That is not good. He is scarfed. We're going to lose Agron there. Uh, float soul, float soul. We have choice band, aqua jet. Let me see here. Float soul. Uh, we're gonna be we're adamant, right? Yeah, I believe we are. I want to see what this does. Nope, we're jolly. Okay, float soul is jolly. Max attack. Item is choice bands. Uh, and we have Aqua Jet right there. Up against Excadrill. Fluff. It doesn't kill. I wish I was adamant. If I was adamant, it would kill. Actually, no, it wouldn't. So it's okay that I'm jolly. Alright. Um. So it changes everything up for me. You're gonna go. Oh, uh, Crystal is not very high right now. A uh, Hydreigon might be forced to come in and take an EQ here. Let me see how much Hydreigon takes. I got 20 seconds from a non life orb. We're gonna say you're definitely not adamant. We're gonna say you're jolly. I kill you, but take so much damage in the process. Fluff! I gotta bring him in. This is like my best bet, to be honest. Alright, honestly, I might not even go Earth Power, because if you bring in the uh, Tokekiss, I may be screwed. But I'm not scarfed. So I'm just gonna go Earth Power. If it brings Tokekiss, so be it. I'll live one EQ. I can tell you that right now. Are you scared he's gonna switch into the Tokekiss? That's fine. I'll U turn down on that thing. I don't think the rock damage. Earth power fails, obviously. Uh, I, I, I kind of want to bluff the scarf, actually. And just hard switch into uh, Cresselia here. But then you easily read that and go for, like... Fluff. So you probably go for a fighting attack here. You know, can't get Ice Punch. Oh, do I bluff the scarf or a real U-turn? Star Force doesn't do jack. Cresselia can't do much here. I got poison. I got po I poison in me. And if I do that, just bring in the uh, extra drug that bodies me. All right. I'll bring in Nidoking. King. Try to catch the Aura Sphere. And then see what happens. Rocks dig into me, and then here comes the Aura Sphere. Or the Air Slash, that works too. Alright. If I go Poison Jab, you're donezo. If I go EQ, I catch Excadrill. I think I'm just gonna go EQ, guys. Because with Poison Jab, you're not bringing Guja or something. He stayed in the first time. Is he going to stay in again? Should I just play it safe because I'm scared? Should I go for the EQ? I'm going EQ. I want him to be scared of this Nidoking. I want you to be scared of this Nidoking. I want you to switch out, Elliot. If you stay in again, it's really... I'm, I think I lose again if he stays in. Pretty sure I lose if he stays in. This is a big risk for me. But I need it. Oh, I need it. Just show me you switch out. Just switch out. Just switch out. It's a 50-50 to be honest. Poison Jabber EQ is what he's thinking. Oh, I'm nervous. This is going to make or break. This is going to make or break, guys. This is going to make or break. Oh, I'm nervous. I kind of wish my Poison Jab now, but I'm already locked in. I'm committed. I'm committed. I'm going for the read. I'm going for the read, guys. I'm nervous. Hopefully it pays off. Let's see. He's thinking. He's thinking long and hard. He's thinking long and hard. 
first thing is poison jab, air slash, magic code, and an unknown. We lose. We lose, we lose, we lose. I don't get... I don't get it. I just don't get it. I just don't get it. I'm, I'm on tilt now. I'm pissed, to be honest. I could have had basically two free kills, assuming he was not Wakan Barry on the Vaporeon. My hope is he forgets Rockstar, but touches that for God knows what reason. game guys nothing I can do nothing I can really do I gotta bring in Floatzel here and just go for waterfalls so I go crash you bring in the extra door or at least I would think you would bring an extra door I, I, I don't know all right Let's just go for a waterfall here and watch the uh watch the uh Guja come in Watch him switch now. Just watch him switch now. Should I just get rid of the... Should I just go for the uh, switcheroo here? I might do that. But no, in my luck, he randomly brings in Metacham and I get nothing out of it. Hmm. Alright, uh... Just go Ice Punch. I, I, I don't know. Alright, Bandit Ice Punch. Not enough. Where's the Roost? Should've gone such a room. Just do it again. Maybe we'll get a Freeze. And we get a crit, who knows? Hey, I got a crit. We did it, guys. Oh, no, I didn't get a crit. What the hell was that? A high? What the hell was that? I don't know what changed, but I'll take it. Goodbye to that thing right there. All right, we got a kill with Floatzel. Oh, boy. We're down by a little now, so if we can bring it back, we're going to see Extra Drill come in here and just EQ everything for game. Uh, I, I, it's, it's, you just bring an extra deal here and win. But hopefully it doesn't. Maybe he'll bring in, like, Volcarona and give me a chance. I, I, I don't know what to, what to do here. If we bring in Volcarona, I'll just go into Crest and Poison you in case you go for Crib Dances and whatnot. And then I'll, uh, I, I don't know. Blueberry. Metacham comes in. Alright, he's gonna be going for Fake Out Gargle. Alright. Uh, that does it to switch out at least. Whoops. Bring in the crest. Uh, I gotta catch extra. I gotta kill the extra drill. My only way I win this game is I like, kill extra drill. Cause then crest can win me the game. If we kill extra drill, crest can win me the game. But he's gonna mega evolve and he's gonna go for like fake out or maybe he'll miss high jump. Kick or something. I, I, I don't know. But this game is pretty much over, guys. At this rate, Let's see what this does to me. Not much at all. Um, has a crit too. Wow, that does nothing. All right, I want to go Moonblast, but because he apparently he stands in for everything, but I, I I can't see him standing this time. I really can't. I really can't. I really can't see him staying in. But you know, I could get actually in, in, uh, in uh, Aqua Jet range. So you know what? Let's just stay in. And go for a... 
Moonblast here. Let's just do it. Let's just stay in. Okay, this thing is toxic. Alright, that's fine. I get two shot it right now anyway. Ruin the longevity. Bring in the, go for the Moonblast. Do about half two at most if we're lucky. Yep. Attack falls. Doesn't matter at all. Alright, what do I do now? Do I call Extra Joe to come in finally? Or do I just stay in and... I don't even know. I want to say Extra Joe is uh, scarfed and not sashed. Almost positive it's scarfed. I'll go for another moon blast. Yep, there's the extra drill. I get a little damage on him. We want to get him in aqua jet range. We want to get this thing in aqua jet range. not quite there. It is not quite there yet. Ah, oh, man. Let's see here. Uh, one more Sashok put, should put you in that range. Yep, we go Sajak, put you in aqua jet range, hopefully. We knew that was happening, so that's that. Go for the Psy Shock. And depending on your EVs, you might be in range right now. He's gonna go EQ, and... I'm gonna drop to that. Most likely. I'll just do it again. Just sucks. If I played basic bland vanilla, I'd probably win this game. But I just went for basic attacks. So it really sucks. I still have Nidoking King right now. Still have Zerker Tree. Alright, who's coming in? Fine by me. Get some Sashak damage off on you. Neutral damage. Get you an Aqua Jet range as well. All right, get back in this game a little bit. Get back in this game a little bit. And we're gonna die right here. Just in case, which is that again, I'm gonna go for side shock, but pretty sure he's not gonna. Pretty sure he goes for a drain punch here. So let's see what Floatzel could do. Oh, this is Metacham, Mega, Metacham, Mega, because Floatzel could still win us the game, dude. Floatzel could still win us this game. Give it a choice bands. Right, what was that? Thunder Punch? Let me see. Ooh, are you in Aqua Jet range? I gotta basically hope you are. All right, go for it, Floatzel. Go for it, Floatzel! Oh, uh, wait a minute. I outspeed you. I could just go Waterfall. I could just go Waterfall here. Let's so outspeed you. Or I could go Ice Punch. Just gonna let him drop. Uh, <sighs> I might still go Aqua Jet just so you can't bring in the extra drill. You might be skipping. Then you bring in Gudra. I, I don't know. It's tough here. Let me think. I think I just go Waterfall.
Because it hits everything but the Gudra. So if I go Ice Punch and bring an extra drill and I'm just screwed. I go Waterfall. Skull, kill a Blueberry. Get that thing out of here. Very nice. And I think extra just comes in and wins the game. There's no way I'm loving an EQ unless he's not scarfed. It's my only chance is if he's not scarfed. It's my only chance. It's my only chance. Uh, Octet, 85% is the max damage on him. There's a chance to go to extra drill. He's around that range, but... I gotta somehow switch out extra, uh, this float soul. Wish I was life orb, man. Oh well. There's Monty, so you, you gotta be scarfed. There's no reason why you bring this thing in. Break the mold, I'm pretty sure EQ kills me. Yeah, EQ kills me. Once it gets the lowest roll known to man. Alright, let's see if he's scarfed. He definitely is, but. That's game. GG. My boy floats all right now, giving us some life. Alright, this is a closer game than I thought now. I mean, we probably still lose because the rocks are enough to kill that the Volcarona, but... Let's see. Kuja comes in. I just go Waterfall because I got a rocks. Can't switch it back in, obviously. I got a Waterfall here. And, uh... Gotta hope I get Dark Pulse flinches. That sucks, man. I could have won this game so easily. It's so, oh, it's so dumb to know that. Oh, well! It's Pokemon that happens. You will predict you lose the game. This man had balls to stay in and he stayed in. I guess he earned it. Simple as that. Let's see what happens though. Nah, I'm glad I'm not life with obviously. Let me get a crit, that'd be awesome. Ah, uh, if only, only, only there was some way to not lose this game. But I still have Nidoking to win this game, man. It all came down to that Poison Jab versus EQ against the uh, stupid freaking Togekiss. Oh well. What can you do? What can you do? I go Draco here. Uh, Nothing I can do. Game's over. It's gonna be one off. That sucks so bad, dude. Sucks so bad. Great. If Rocks are still up, I get a crit. Maybe, but. Also, maybe I didn't bring Bug Stab. I don't know. Let's see, that's not Volcano, no, that's Volcano. Should I be going Earth Paris here? What should I be doing? Uh. Which is Dark Pulse do? Pretty good amount, I could get a flinch. Well, I'm at neg two. Dark Pulse does nothing to you. Uh, I am Life Orb, though. I forget, a Draco Meteor off and a crit, I win. If I could live a Bug Buzz, if, I, if he didn't bring Bug Step, which I doubt he did. Uh, I need Dark Pulse flinches. Dark Pulse flinch, maybe? Who knows, let's see. Oh, he's Scarf too. Okay. GG. Well done. Or he's fully invested in speed. Okay, you got it. Well, guys. I'm honestly really upset with this loss.
Makes zero sense to me. It really does. And, but, Pokemon, what can you do? Catch you guys later. We'll see you next time.